The St. Augustine Wild Reserve is a non-profit, non-breeding rescue center that provides homes for unwanted exotic animals. Deborah Warwick, the founder of the reserve, and her volunteers have so far rescued a total of 70 animals, ranging from lions and tigers to wolves, snakes, and lemurs. In 1981, Deborah Warwick created the Soul of the Wolves in California, which was a center built to rescue wolves. In 2000, the location was moved to St. Augustine to become the St. Augustine Wild Reserve, which has grown to house a lot more than just wolves. The animals at the St. Augustine Wild Reserve have been rescued not only from neighborhoods, but from all sorts of locations. Five Arctic wolves in the African lion Mufasa were rescued from Michael Jackson, who wanted to remove them from his ranch near Santa Barbara. In addition, many of the reserve's animals were liberated from wildlife agencies without proper state permits, or who starved the animals and made them live under inferior conditions. Onyx is one of the black leopards living at the reserve. He has survived bone cancer but lost a leg in the process. He became somewhat famous when he appeared on Ripley's Believe It or Not TV show as the world's most unbelievable animal. Now, this is Mufasa, he's, this, he's being uncooperative now. But he is an African lion, he weighs about 600 pounds, and I got him from a breeder in Kansas when he was three months old. Uh, the breeder was trying to sell him into the pet market and could not find a home for him, and he was scheduled for euthanasia because he couldn't find a home, and I decided to take him, so I paid for the shipping and got him flown out to California where my compound was, and so I've raised him since that time, which was 1995. So he went from a three-month-old, 35-pound kitty into the beautiful African lion that you see behind us, weighing at about 600 pounds. The St. Augustine Wild Reserve is an institution that is dependent solely on donations and the generosity of others. Currently, the reserve feeds the animals 1,000 pounds of meat a week, 20 to 30 pounds of fruits and vegetables a day, 50 pounds of kibble, chicken feed, and canned cat food for the smaller cats. Also, the reserve has 45 cages, which provide homes for almost all 70 animals, except the birds and goats, which wander to entertain the caged animals. By donating to the reserve, you would help pay for the animals' food, equipment to keep the animals healthy and happy, and hopefully new cages for new rescued animals. You can find information on how to donate by going to www.staugustinewildreserve.org. Or you can come for a tour of the reserve, offered once or twice weekly by appointment only, which includes a $20 donation per person.